Founded by John Parker in 1985, Yeti and its turquoise bikes earned a place in mountain biking lore thanks to legendary racers like John Tomac, Julie Furtado, Missy Giovi, and Miles Rockwell. Racing has always been in Yeti's blood, and it still builds bikes that help the world's best riders win at the highest level. But it's also a small company of dedicated riders who love designing and riding mountain bikes. You won't find any gravel or road bikes in their lineup, just pure, single track slaying machines sure to satisfy everyone from dentists to hardcore trail riders. So how do you choose which Yeti mountain bike is right for you? Today, we're gonna break down Yeti's lineup and help you pick your next ride. Yeti's current full suspension bikes are designated SB for Superbike, followed by a number indicating the rear travel millimeters. For example, the SB115, the shortest travel bike Yeti currently makes, has 115 millimeters of rear travel. At the other end of the spectrum, Yeti's longest travel bike, the SB165, has 165 millimeters of travel. In between, you have the SB130, SB140, and SB150, giving you plenty of options to suit your style or terrain. For those who are particular about wheel size, the SB140 and 165 are designed around playful 27.5 wheels, while the SB115, 130, and 150 use 29 inch wheels. All models use Yeti's Switch Infinity suspension system. The main pivot moves up at the beginning of the stroke, but then switches direction as the bike moves through its travel. This provides anti-squat high in the travel for efficient pedaling, but when descending hard, the anti-squat drops off to provide mid-stroke support and a plush, bottomless feel. Bikes come in two levels, the standard Carbon Series and the top of the line Turk Series. Turk models cost more and use the highest quality carbon fiber available to optimize weight and stiffness. Standard Carbon Series frames are still high performance and the overall ride will feel similar but Turk Series frames will weigh 200 to 400 grams less. As is the case with most bikes, riders who are interested in pedaling or climbing efficiency, or who ride flatter and less technical trails will prefer models with less travel, like the SB115. Riders more interested in downhill speed and sending big features will want more travel from bikes like the SB150 or 165. If you're looking for an all-rounder trail bike, then the SB130 or 140 will do the trick. While we can't go into detail on every model in this short video, it's worth calling out the SB150. This is the bike used by Yeti's factory enduro race team, and it's proven itself with wins in the Enduro World Series. With 29-inch wheels and a 170mm fork, it'll eat up the gnarliest descents. If you're looking for a competitive enduro race bike, the SB150 is among our top picks. And if you're into Yeti's style, but want something simpler, Yeti has reintroduced its ARC hardtail for 2021. Unlike the old ARC, it's no longer a pure XC bike. The carbon frame uses modern trail geometry and is built around a 130mm fork to produce a capable and fun trail hardtail. So which Yeti bike do you ride? Or which do you wish you rode? Let us know in the comments and thanks for watching!